The Half Moon Bay Planning Commission debated for hours on the plan to build a five-story, 40-unit building. The final vote came early this morning. This all comes after last year's mass shooting that exposed the poor living conditions that so many farm workers are forced into. ABC 7 News reporter Gloria Rodriguez has been following this story all morning for us. She joins us live in Half Moon Bay with the latest. Gloria. Yeah, you know, this is where that farm worker housing could end up, but there has been some opposition, and this is not a done deal yet. It's uh, great, you know, that the Planning Commission approved this project, although we aren't claiming victory yet. Uh, there's quite a few steps uh, ahead of ours. This house at 555 Kelly Avenue in Half Moon Bay could become a five story, 40 unit housing for senior farm workers that would also include a resource center. Nonprofit Alas and Mercy Housing have been working on the project. We're going to have resources for the farm workers that are going to be living here on 555 Kelly uh, with medical, um, dental, and again, it's a prime location because they're able to walk, you know, to the clinic, uh, to the church, to the grocery store. But there have been concerns about the height of the building, parking that could cause traffic congestion, and that's not all. Tuesday marked the third hours long meeting the commission discussed and questioned the project. Just reassure me yes. that your financing is not going to fall apart. The questions we're asking are not about the importance of these services. We're, we're trying to understand the land use. Supporters of the project packed Tuesday night's planning commission meeting that went until after midnight with the commission voting in favor. The push comes after last year's mass shooting where seven farm workers were killed on two farms. The tragedy exposing their poor living conditions. Last week, the governor threatened legal action against the Half Moon Bay Planning Commission, calling for a delay to vote egregious. But Mayor Joaquin Jimenez Ureña says it was not delayed, but is just part of the process. I know they were accused of delaying the, the process, but they were not. It's uh, something that it takes, you know, for a Half Moon Bay to, uh, to develop Half Moon Bay. And I'm, I'm glad they came to a conclusion. So it's uh, looking into details, uh, the size, the space, what the space is going to be used for. Uh, so what is being proposed? And before the project can move forward, it needs to be voted on by the city council. Live in Half Moon Bay, Gloria Rodriguez, ABC 7 News.